Hey, what's going on? I'm Devin. I'm Jeff. And we are Basic Bros Reaction. Hey, what's going on? It is Basic Bros Reactions here, and we are excited because we are dropping a reaction to a soloist, uh, Taeyong, and her new video uh, for What Do I Call You? And so, um, she's pretty much, she's pretty iconic. She's part of, she was, or is, she still is part of Girls' Generation, and she was a leader of, of them, and she's had a very impressive solo career. Um, everything from kind of branching off on her own and she's like done you were talking about like for frozen yeah <laughs> did some some thinking with that and um i feel like she's one of those idols that like has such an interesting story like you know with a lot of stuff that she's had to deal with within, within the industry of uh, both highs and lows from you know like I said once again being the leader of the nation's girl group mm -hmm. um, girls generation but also all the adversity she had to face with that and, and whatnot and the fact that she's still around still producing great songs and videos and still you know still very competitive out here, this really, really says a lot to her uh, about her. And she just has such an incredible voice. Like uh, she's got one of the best voices in K-pop. I mean, I would say so. Yeah, I mean that does speak to like her longevity because I mean, Girls' Generation was like I feel like it was a lifetime ago. Like yeah, yeah. So I mean, for her to still be like relevant, and so I mean it's impressive, really. So I mean I'm looking forward to lis listening to the song and. Seen the video? I'm yeah. curious what it sounds like. Yeah, yeah. And I'm, I'm curious to see if it fits in into like the whole SM um, universe thing, mm -hmm. and if there's going uh, to be like any like teasers or anything for like the next SM artist or whatever, like Espo was for Boa and like different things like that. So yeah, I just I just don't have I I don't even know what to expect really. So yeah, I'm just kind of going. Yeah, and with a lot of her stuff because she's usually was usually known for kind of like more kind of ballads but then mm -hmm. kind of recently she's been doing some kind of more mid-tempo songs and whatnot so um i don't know but i kind of feel like with the title it's going to be a little bit more of a like slow burn like kind of like, <laughs> you know ballad you know <laughs> i'm excited to i'm excited to find out <laughs> <laughs> we will get into this reaction in three two one You might be right. Might be a slow burn in the Yeah. I like those bangs on it. Yeah. I like the little blonde, like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like the little The vocals are just so powerful. The control. I really like the. This is video. I like how clean this video is, but at the same time, it's like not like extravagantly so. It's kind of like very, um, I don't know how to say it. Kind of reminds me of just like a regular person in <laughs> apartment. Yeah. Yeah. 
Usually the K-pop ones, they're, they're like living in like mansions. <laughs> you see like mansions and everything's very extravagant. These are humble beginnings. <laughs> <laughs> video or something or like the next artist. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> you know, I thought it was a pretty good song. I enjoyed the song. The, the video was pretty cool. It was it, Like I said, it wasn't like over the top extravagant or crazy or anything. Um, it was a pretty simple video as far as the aesthetics were involved. Um, I enjoyed the song. The vocals were like, you know, they were top notch. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, the the song was like very, it was like kind of like a vibe to it. Yeah, I, yeah, I it. was, yeah. yeah, I really, um, yeah. I didn't know what to expect I, going into it. And like, it looked was like it was gonna be a super with, bummer like, song. Yeah. yeah. Like a super sad. Yeah. And I like how it's like, uh, like you were saying, kind of like a breakup song and it's kind of like sad, but then like the beat is kind of like somewhat upbeat or kind uh, of like more yeah. like cheerful. It's kind of like that dichotomy and, and whatnot with the lyrics. I thought that, that was really cool. And like I said, her voice was just incredible. And I like her, her, her aesthetics because it reminded me of a few of her other videos where they're just kind of simple, but I feel like they go so perfectly for a song like this. Like, you mm -hmm. know what, like over the top, like yeah. type of thing. Cause I think that like you were saying, it's kind of a vibe. And so like, mm -hmm. um, the song was like I really enjoyed the song and the lyrics. I think were really like I think because the video was didn't have so much crazy stuff going on. Mm -hmm. I could concentrate a little bit more on the lyrics and kind yeah, of attached to the song even more through that. So yeah, same here. Because like I was actually reading some of the lyrics. So I was like, some of it was like pretty relevant. Because um, I mean, once you break up, you're not sure like it's kind of like a weird dynamic mm -hmm. most people don't even talk anymore so i mean if you, you you are still in contact like what do you like you used to call them like babe or something it's kind of weird now that you just call them by their name and then there's like a part in there like as far as like distance wise how far do you keep them like arms free uh, arms length wise like you can't text them or call them like every day like you used to or you know so it's kind of like um it's kind of like a tough line that you kind of kind of like Kind of figure out for yourself. Yeah, so, I got now. If you decide to, so. but most people are just like, oh, <laughs> no, like no, yeah, well, <laughs> yeah. Who cares? Um, I'm never talking to you again. Oh my god, that makes it easy, I guess. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that was a good song. I love. I enjoyed the lyrics. Yeah, it was very meaningful. Mm -hmm. I'd probably give it. Um, if I were to rate it, I'd probably give it. Um, I'd probably give it a nine. I really enjoyed it. Yeah. So. Mm -hmm. I would give it um, an 8.8. .8. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the vibe was just really cool. And the lyrics were, were really, were got me along with her voice. And mm -hmm. just, like I said, I always have a deep appreciation, especially with soloists, because it's so much harder. Because when you're in a group, you have so many voices that mm -hmm. you can pull for, from and whatnot. But when it's yeah. yourself, you have to basically carry and keep people interested in the song. And a lot of the things that she was doing vocally kept it entertaining um, mm -hmm. and, and whatnot. And kept you really in tune to what was going on. And I, I really enjoyed it. So yeah. yeah, and there wasn't really like anything like choreography wise for us to like that would take our attention away from basically the song and the lyrics. Yes. Yeah, so which was yeah. refreshing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was, was, yeah, it was nice. Yeah, mm -hmm. nice change up. Yeah. So, anyways, let us know down in the comments what you thought of the video. Uh, don't forget to hit that like and that subscribe button, and to ding that bell so you get notified whenever we are dropping videos. And we are Basic Bros Reactions. <laughs>